So a young boy is expected to make a full recovery, which is really good news. This is after he was attacked by an alligator in the water where Lake Pontchartrain meets Bayou St. John in New Orleans. It's really scary and it happened Sunday. And as Mike McDaniel explains, the boy's father is being credited with saving his life. Casey Caldwell and her friend routinely walk along Lake Pontchartrain near Bayou St. John, where it's not uncommon to see an alligator or two. Every other time, for sure. Right, if you stand still long enough, you'll definitely spot one. We spotted this one Wednesday morning. It's the same area where a nine-year-old boy was attacked by an alligator Sunday evening. People should not be letting their kids or dogs swim in this bayou at all. According to the Department of Wildlife and Fisheries, the boy was with family while in the shallow water when he was attacked. First responders say his dad started beating the estimated six foot gator, which then let the boy go with wounds to one of his legs. He was taken to the hospital and is now recovering at home. This is the second time in less than a year that we know of that an alligator has attacked a child in the waters of Lake Pontchartrain. Back in late August, a three year old was attacked by an alligator at long closed Lincoln Beach. The child was taken to Children's Hospital, but their condition was never released. Weeks later, this alligator caused a stir along the lake between Orleans Avenue and Canal Boulevard. That's near where Jerry Latner casts his fishing line weekly. He says he saw two gators about two weeks ago. If you be in the water, you got to um, be careful what you do. And you got to be careful how the way you move in the water. Wildlife and fisheries agents were called out to where the boy was attacked to try and find the gator, but no luck. Most of the time, alligators are fearful of humans. The agency's alligator program manager, Jeb Linscombe, says alligator attacks in Louisiana are extremely rare, but folks need to be mindful around the water. Just assume, assume there may be alligators in, in this water bottom somewhere. Just because I don't see them doesn't mean they're not there visible or not, it has Caldwell being cautious. We're in their habitat. I mean, the swamps are right over there on the other side of the lake, so be careful. Mike McDaniel, WWL, Louisiana. Alligator warning signs are said to be installed in that area by the Louisiana Flood Protection Authority. There's no date on when those signs will be ready to install.